Okay, you guys. Taking a video request. Video request. For Chateau the Hedgehog. The Last Way. I kind of got a stand going on. Kind of hard to see the TV screen, but this is really the best I can do. Sound like a bunch of boxes, so if one of these fall, the whole thing pretty much falls. That's bad. Alright, I'm going to get right to it. Um, I'm not going to show you any of the cutscenes, I'm just going to skip them, mainly because uh, I don't want this video to be super long, because it will like, take forever to put on the YouTube, and I really don't need that right now. So, I'm just going to show you the last way, the person that requested it will be set. Right. Playing this on my Wii. Very cool system. Got it on Wii Connect 24. I love it. Waiting for Brawl to come out. That'll be a fun game. Okay, is there any way? I'm only getting like half the screen. This is too long. That should make it a little brighter. Yeah, there we go. Okay, here we go. This level is basically pretty much just like the Black Comet level. Just run through as fast as you can. You have a time limit. Collect as many rings as you can and kill all the enemies as fast as you can. Grab as many weapons as you can. Because you're always going to need to use chaos control. Oh, God. Come on. Okay. The easiest guys to kill are the little... Or... Or, uh... No, they're like... Enemies with pretty much armor on them. They're the easiest to build up the fastest. So remember, you always want chaos control. Always. It's going to get you to the level the fastest, and you're always going to need it. Certain parts are going to need to progress through. Pro yeah, pro progress through. It's my fault. Like these guys right here. They get you the fastest, and they have like the best guns. The more you use chaos to control, the less you have to go through. There are certain parts that are harder. So any enemy you see, just, just kill them. Just don't stop. Just go. Go through the red street and then right out into a park. Now if you're really risky and you want to go for a shortcut, you can jump off the middle of this and if you're lucky, you'll hit the direct center without killing yourself. Kind of like that, but you actually can get in the middle. I just skipped the rail pretty much. Ah, oh, crap! We have to build up chaos control again. This is a bad spot not to have it. You need it here. Get into 
the shit. That's the easiest because you can just stay there and wait till you build it up. Now here's a spot you're gonna want to build it up fast because at the very end of this part you're gonna have to use chaos control to advance on. So just kill every enemy you can and build it up. All those people. Not a very likely choice of a weapon in my opinion, but it's the best I can do. This is another part. At the very end, you're going to need to use Chaos Control again. Now, I'm too close, and I don't think my Chaos Control will reach the end, so I might have to save it. I just have to keep it on enemies so it continues to go up. But I have enough! That was a suck of work that I did. Huge shortcut. Okay, the easiest to do here is just blow up the rocks. And, okay, here's another spot where you're going to have to use chaos control to advance, but it makes it pretty easy. Because I'm running out of time. It makes it pretty easy because there's enemies everywhere. Hurry. Um, to the sides, there are bigger enemies, which will build up your uh, chaos control gauge faster. Hero gauge, whatever you want to call it. All right, here we go. Should be at the end very soon. Not very good. Whenever you're in any of these, just kill as fast as you can. You're gonna need it at the end. I can almost trust you there, but there's so many giants that you're going to get your gauge filled instantaneously. Oh, I guess you didn't hear that. Okay, here's the end of the level. And that's the level. And that is where I will end the video. Thank you for watching. This has been the last way request. Anytime you need a video request, count on it.